today we're going to cover the WordPress property plugin and this is for use if you have a real estate website or something like that. So we're going to go into the menu on the left hand side and go to properties and settings and that will take us to the main settings tab. We want to move over to developer. Now what this lets you do here is you can add different attributes like address, price, bedroom or you can add property metadata like lease terms and pet policy school district or you can add property types a building or a floor plan within a building a single family home condominium or townhouse once you make a building type you can then decide you know what attributes do I want hidden and what do I want shown for instance uh, under our attributes we have something like HOA dues now HOA dues would apply to maybe a condominium or a townhouse but not a single family home so when you go down to single family home and you toggle these hidden attributes, you're going to hide deposit, you're going to hide HOA dues, you're going to hide pet policy. You can be selective in what attributes you decide to show and hide. So let's add a row. Let's add apartment, even though usually for apartment you would own you know, you would own the um, building and you'd have a floor plan. But for the sake of argument, we're going to add an apartment as a property type. And we're going to make it searchable and have location matters. And then we're going to decide to hide different things. Like we might hide HOA dues. I don't, I don't know. Or we might hide, um, hmm. We might hide lot size because that usually applies to a single family home things like that. And let's say we wanted to add a, uh, a property attribute. What about um, floor level would apply maybe to a floor plan in a building, but what if we want number of floors for a single family home? So number of floors. We make that searchable. And now that will show up in all of them. So let's save this. Save changes. And now number of floors is an attribute and apartment is a property type. So now if I go to uh, properties add property and I want to add a condominium, I can set things like the address or even the number of floors which is the attribute we just added. or I can set uh, you know, our new property type apartment, things like that. So that's the basics of how to add property types and property attributes using the WordPress property plugin.